Hello, good morning, evening, afternoon, whatever it is for you as you're watching this video. My name is Brittany and I'm here to share the six day juice feast that I just finished. Um, I went on this juice feast because I found that I needed to clean out my body. I've been eating very bad, very bad for the past couple weeks, maybe three weeks prior to the juice feast. I was eating a lot more cooked food um, and on the side note you can research that but cooked food isn't bad for you but in, ref in um, contrast to eating a lot more whole foods, a lot more fruit, a lot more veggies, a lot more raw, it does make a difference. You have more energy on this side. And I was switching over and found that I was getting heavier sluggish, you know, I was feeling like I wasn't clean on the inside. I was also eating candy. I know, terrible vegan candy, but it was still candy and junk. And I found that my body started to feel it. I was feeling gross on the inside. And as I said, I was losing energy, and that's another reason why I decided to juice, because I needed to get my, my clear mind back, my energy back. I also juice for self-control. I would like some self-control. I am a sweets person. That's why I love fruit. I love fruit. I love bananas. I love pears. I love watermelon. But I found that the more I started drifting from that, the more I started to just focus on junk and sweets and um, I can't have that and it, it gets a hold of you because your body craves it um, and that's why you need more fruit and I, I've changed I've stopped eating like that I haven't eaten candy but that's one of the reasons why I found I needed to juice also weight loss I know crazy that's not my number one reason but it is at the top that I would like to lose more weight in this juice piece, I've lost about 7.4 pounds, which equals out to about 3.5 kilos for all those non-American people out there who don't use pounds, um, which is really cool because it was about a pound a day, a little over a pound a day because my juice piece was six days, and it was surprising. I was actually surprised that I lost 7.4, and on a side note as well, I will be gaining a couple of those pounds back, which is absolutely normal due to water weight with food and digestion and now your body has more in there totally normal and i'm okay with that um i didn't just do it for the weight loss i did it for so much more um there are several things that i have benefited from during my juices so you know so the the first three days as i shared in a video prior they were hard the third day was really bad my stomach hurt so bad felt like, again, like there was a hand like grabbing my belly, trying to squeeze me to death. But after that, I had energy. I had a clearer mind. I felt great. Um, I noticed my skin had cleared up. I noticed that I felt lighter. Like I felt more energy and light. I felt light, which is really amazing. I spent about $50 to $60 for all my product. For all you need to know that. So make sure to know how much you need if you're trying to go on this journey. Don't just hop in there going, well, YOLO, let's do it. No, like make sure you know because you will find it very surprising if you under budget. And it will be discouraging because you can't, you can't go into a juice feast without really feasting. That makes sense. Some people, my friend actually today was like, a feast? No, this is a fast. <laughs> but I like to call it a feast because it, it helps my mindset think I'm not doing this as a restrictive thing. I'm not trying not to get a lot of juice. I need to make sure I have a lot of juice. And the, the word feast makes you feel like I can have it abundantly, which is exactly how it is. Five benefits to juice feasting that I have found beneficial to me. One, it cleans out your organs, cleans out your liver, cleans out your kidneys, cleans you out. It helps your heart. It helps your... Like I have asthma and I know I feel better when... I'm eating right and juicing is a good boost. I don't recommend it as a lifelong, should be juicing for the rest of your life, but I do find it beneficial to have a reboot as your body can really focus on healing and strengthening those things that work so hard for us. Two, digestion. I know that a lot of people have digestive tract issues where they get sick, they get constipated, and it really does help to reset that digestive tract. Three, clear skin. People struggle with acne, people struggle with uh, blemishes and breakouts and anything like that. It really does help to clear your skin out. And don't be surprised during the detox phase if it seems like it got worse. 
which it does happen because your body is cleaning out. But after that initial detox, you will find your skin clearer than it had ever been before. Four, I love the fact that I have more energy, uh, which is huge for me because I, when I'm tired, and I, anyone can speak for this, but when I'm tired, it's over. <laughs> it's so hard to think, it's so hard to function, it's so hard to speak English, I don't know why, but when I'm tired, I, I go crazy. Five, weight loss. A lot of people go into it with this as their number one goal, which is totally fine. For me, this is at the top of the list, of course, but it's not always the number one because I want to lose weight, but I want to have energy. I want to be happy and I want to feel like I'm benefiting my body, not just restricting it. And as you go through, I really do recommend researching. Make sure you do as much research as you possibly can so that you know what your body needs if you're trying to do a juice feast. Know the cost. Know what the detox symptoms are. Know what the benefits are. And also, go into it with the mindset that you can do it. You can do it for three days. One day, you can do it for 10 days, 20 days, whatever you want. But make sure you go into it with a faithful, positive attitude. And I know for me, my biggest thing is I want to inspire people. And one fact about me before and after, <laughs> and I'll be posting before and after pictures soon, is I lost almost 19 pounds doing the vegan lifestyle. 18.8 to be exact, which is about 8.5 kilos for all those people, again, who don't use pounds. And to me, that is tremendous. My goal had always been to lose 20 pounds, and I thought I never could do it. And I had tried for years. I've done insanity. I tried the lemon juice fast. I tried restricting using calorie counters, and I tried all these things, but I never could do it. And I realized it's because my mindset was wrong. I didn't realize that I could lose weight and still be abundant in my eating. There's these memes out there that say, <laughs> a woman's desire is to be able to eat as much as she wants and not gain any weight. And that is completely true for me. <laughs> I would like to eat as much as I want without gaining weight. And of course, the answer to doing that is you got to eat abundant, healthy food, not abundant junk food. And for me, that took me becoming vegan. And I'll tell you my story later about why I became vegetarian, vegan in the first place. But one aspect is health. And I really want to be healthy, happy, be able to live an amazing life as God intended. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you have a great day evening, night, whatever it is for you, and I hope you come and watch my videos again. Bye!